Today I'm putting counterweights into this golf grip. What's happening Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I've got this golf club. This actually isn't for me, but it's actually for a friend that I've been putting together a club based on his request for specific specs. And one of the things that we're gonna do here is actually put in a counterweight into the end of the golf grip. So I actually got these, these are by Tour Lock and this is the pro set here and this is their starter kit so it comes with a bunch of different weights actually what's interesting is one of these is quite long so what's going to happen here is that these are going to go into the back end of the shaft and so the weight is going to be up here it's not going to stick out from the club it's going to be a very discreet way of putting in counterweights but however one of the things that this does is that it's going to put the weight into the shaft but why we're putting this in is basically we're kind of duplicating the zexio clubs here so we're actually going to put in a pretty light weight now this set here comes with a bunch of different weights it looks like four of them this one is 12 grams 20 grams 30 and then this one is quite heavy i'm not sure what this one is right off the top of my head but this might be best used in something like a putter now tour lock actually makes counterweights that can go all the way down the shaft this is not this this just goes in the end now i want to show you what we get here is a little cutting tool it's a little drill bit i have a drill here that we are going to use it also comes with a allen key here and that's how you're going to lock these in so here's the counterweight itself it has a little bit of this metal flange on the end that's what you'll see you can see it's got a hex head on the top there that's how we're going to tighten it down the weight is in here and then we have this little rubber sleeve right there and what's going to happen here is that once you get this into the club what you're going to do is use this allen key to turn this and i think that's going to kind of compress this it's like a self anchoring bolt for drywall and that is kind of bulging out and that's what's going to hold it inside of your golf club shaft so the first thing i need to do here is cut the back end of the grip off so what we get here is this little circular cylindrical blade we have a guide here a little pin in the middle that will go into the middle of the hole in the bottom of your grip here just like that and then this side here will fit into the chuck of your drill so I'll just go ahead and tighten that in. And this edge right here is a sharpened blade. So let's hope I don't screw up this club, but I should just be able to go ahead and center this just like that. And now drill in there and push through the grip. Just like that. And I wonder if it'll pull it out. So it actually pulls out the plug right there, which is really nice. So now I have a hole in there. You might have some tape in there. It may have cut through the tape. Depending on the type of grip material, you might actually have to kind of put a little more muscle into it. And I can actually just use a T here and pull out that tape, which is nice. And now I'm going to take this counterweight right here. This is the 12 gram one for this club and push it right in there. Fits in just like that. And now I'm just going to take this Allen key and tighten the sucker in. And that makes it a pretty permanent installation. Now I say pretty permanent because what I can do is obviously loosen this up, take it out. So let's say I upgrade clubs, I regrip at some point. I don't lose these, I can just remove them, I can put them in a different club. Maybe you're playing around with this and you say, hey, this 12 gram weight is too light, I want a little more weight. I put mine right around my midsection. But you can take this out and put in that 20 gram weight or 40 gram weight or whatever you wanna do and you can order more weights as well from their website. So if you need some extra weights, if you wanted to put in a 12 gram weight into all your iron, something like that, you could certainly order a dozen of those. But what I love is that it goes right in there, it's a nice flush fit looks good it's not obvious and it's just going to add a little bit of weight down here on the club it's going to remove some swing weights on the club so the club is going to feel a little lighter maybe a little easier to swing maybe a little quicker release maybe more speed so there's all sorts of reasons that you might want this you might want the extra assistance you might just like having the feel of a heavier club whatever it might be maybe you put extra weight on the head that you want to offset a little bit so it's kind of a nice easy way to do it we just did it right here on camera so if you want to pick up the tour lock pro counterweights because it's going to make your golf game a little better i'll put a link to it in the description below peter von panda out we can discover more and explore so much deeper.